Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead and today I'm making washing soda. I've already done this video before but I ran out of washing soda and I've been to the local grocery stores and hardware stores and nobody carries it anymore. So it's really simple to make, folks. Like I was just being lazy looking for it in the store. You take plain baking soda and you put it on a cookie sheet and you preheat your oven to 400 degrees. All we're going to do is bake the moisture out of this. It doesn't work like a washing soda by itself. There's a chemical process it goes through when it's baked. Now, you would not put your head in the oven while you're spraying oven spray. So do not put your head in the oven until after you've opened the door when this is done because it does give off a certain gas and some people are really sensitive to it. Okay, so we're going to bake this at 400 degrees until the squeakiness feels more sandy. And that's it. All right. If it's a thick layer, to every once in a while take it out of the oven or just even once and give it a shake or a stir and put it back in. This whole process probably takes 45 minutes depending on the amount of baking soda. But it's already getting, you can see, it's already getting dusty. Now once it's out of the oven and it's been baked, you're going to notice that it's a very fine powdery consistency. That's what we're looking for. I'm just going to take my old baking soda box and write washing soda. I'm going to peel the lid back here and I'm just going to take our parchment paper and kind of get it all in the center and into the box it goes. And then you clean up your mess. This is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead on how to make washing soda. Take care, God bless.